we got. Oh, what the fuck for? Got a whole bunch of shit to do. Gotta sell all these fucking paintings that are everywhere. Uh, I can't even give those things away, dude. I'm tried. You gotta list all these. I'm trying to sell those. Uh. Yeah, telling people about the scam on eBay. They almost fell for. Oh uh, yeah, the scam. That was shitty. All right, and we gotta tell everybody about my daily choice. Oh yeah, my daily choice. Okay. So that's what we got. We got a lot to do. We gotta tend to the garden. Garden. Ah oh, fuck. Yeah, if you get up, drop your tincture, let's go. Fine. Fine, I'll go. Fine. Let's go. Get up. Come on. Get up. Get up. Time to get up. Get up. You up yet? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, time to get up. We got shit we gotta do. Let's go do it. Come on. Fine. All right. We're up, we're up, we're ready to go. Stay tuned. All right, all right, I'm up. Here we go. Oh, hello. In case you were wondering, that's how I wake up in the morning. A little bit of an argument. Sometimes it takes a little persuasion, especially right around now. You know, I don't get a lot of views. Maybe it's because I don't make enough videos. I want to thank my current subscribers. Appreciate all of you. I'm 337. And uh, thanks for sticking around and watching me struggle making money online. Because that's what I'm doing. I'm struggling trying to make money online. There's a lot of ways to do it. And that's what this channel is about. It's Rugged Rose Review. If you've liked this video thus far... Go ahead and hit that thumbs up button, subscribe, ring the bell, and you'll get all the new video notifications every time I post a video. Sometimes I go on little hiatuses, and sometimes I'll post multiple videos in a day. Hmm. It's like what I want to do. There's a lot to talk about right now, though. Like I was saying, I got scammed. Hmm. That was some bullshit. I'll tell you how. I started this new hobby slash habit addiction i paint these paintings with my daughters it's fun we have a good time and they usually turn out really cool so i started posting them on etsy and ebay because that's a way to make money online that's what i'm trying to do because why now i'm a parent teacher combo right now i'm teaching my kids how many out there have to teach their kids at least three days a week if not all week long let me know in the comments. How's it going for you, right? Are you making money still? Are you still able to work from home? And do what you were doing? And make the same amount of money you were making? I'm trying this my daily choice, right? Another way we're making money online. And you can check those videos out right here. Cool. All that being said, I got scammed almost. Almost. I'm going to say almost because it was shitty. I got my hopes up. And I was real fucking, like, stoked, excited. You know, all the words for, you know. I almost sold that painting. It's on eBay. I put it on there. Sat there for about a week. It went down to from 20 to $19, because that's what they do. And then they charge it. So every time I post something on there, I got charged. And I got to... So please go to eBay and... You know, I'm going to be posting more of these paintings on, on there too, right? And Etsy. But anyways, back to the scam and then the bullshit. Uh, a guy, I got an email from eBay. I got an offer for $150 for that painting. And I was like, wow, that's crazy. Because I only put it on there for 20 and it's a buy now at 50 and you want to pay 150 for it? Maybe he really likes it. I thought, cool, whatever. 
And then it says, uh, so I accept it, you know, 150 bucks. Wow, bang. Fuck yeah, right? I'm on it. And uh, so I accept the offer and it says, text this number. It's when you, you know, for shipping instructions. And this is my first time. This is my first Rodeo. This is my first day on eBay. We dig it. And uh, so I'm excited and a little bit naive and uh, ignorant to some things. Okay. And this is my first sale. So I'm like, fuck yeah. Right. Don't get excited if it says Texas number. Back to the scamming ass eBay buyer. Rich nine fucking whatever the hell the number was. I reported this bitch ass. Because it got my hopes up. And this is how. He said that he would pay $150 for this painting. That was the offer. I accepted it. And he said, I need to ask you to do one thing before you ship this. And he asked me to buy a $300 eBay card and put it in the box. But take a picture of it. A picture of me putting it in the box and shipping it with a proof of purchase. I said, yeah, sure, I'll do that. As soon as you put $450 in my account. And then he also said that he would put some gas money and some other bullshit. And I was like, yeah, fine, whatever. Whenever that money gets into my PayPal account, I'll, I will do all that for you. He said that he couldn't ship to Georgia for some reason. So and his reason was he was in the Marines and he couldn't do it or something or work for the Marines. I thought it was weird and then I kind of just wrote it off but then he hit me up the next day and I said hey I don't have the funds in there yet so I'm gonna, I'm gonna send you some right now I said no shit cool maybe he's not maybe it's for real again so I go along with it and I get an email and it says your funds of 300 or what was it $400 or something, 350 what was it? Anyways, it said my funds were available or would be available as soon as I, you know, did the whole buy the card and make proof of purchase and then it would be unlocked from his PayPal to mine. So I look it up and I look the first number up, they give you like these, this little, some numbers. So I looked them up and right away, the second number I look up, it says scam PayPal, right? It takes me to the PayPal fax and then, so I'm bummed, dude. You gotta watch out for that fucking cocksuckers out there. Apparently they're, it's a Nigerian, I don't know. That's what it said. I'm, I, it doesn't matter where you're from when you're doing that shit. You're just kind of just a dickhead, you know? I mean, I get it. You gotta have a hustle. Why don't you just be legit? You know, why are you ripping people off and being a fucker? You know? Give them something worth something. You know? Anyways, like these paintings. And some CBD. We'll talk more about that kind of thing in the next video. I just wanted to tell you about that scam. And be careful out here trying to make money online. Especially selling stuff on eBay. Alright? I'm new to it. And now I've learned. I hope you have too. If you learned from this video, like it. Follow me for more. Shop Amazon. There's the link in the description below. That helps. There's also some uh, donation buttons down there. All the way at the bottom. And there's some down at the bottom. You need to go look at those. I'm probably going to. Alright, till the next time, folks. Uh, watch this video on my daily toy. If you liked it this far, uh, and if you liked it this thus far, this far, if you've liked this thus far, huh? Yeah. If you've liked, I got things going on. I need you motherfuckers to watch. All right, I'll be right back.